Welcome back, everyone. Now, only on News 5. It's been nearly a year since a Mobile police officer was badly injured on the job in a crash. He still can't live at home. He can barely walk. Officer Clayton Graham's family tells News 5's Brianna Hollis they thought he would be much better by now. Well, this picture right here is Officer Graham's professional photo with the Mobile Police Department. The photo on the other side is what life is like for him now. He needs a walker to stand up. He's in a neck brace, all because of a crash that happened last January. To 11 a.m., January 19th, 2019. Officer Clayton Graham is out patrolling on Halls Mill Road near the Spring Creek Bridge. Someone crashes into his police car. Debris still visible as the sun came up. It's been nearly 365 days since that crash. With each of those days, the Graham family deals with a harsh reality. He can walk a little bit with a walker. He's basically still in a wheelchair. A big step with that right leg. Because this is a person who was in the Marines for all those years, who worked as a police officer, who is a minister, and now you're basically confined to a wheelchair. This is Shannon Foreman. She's charged with crashing into Graham's patrol car. She was arrested for assault first, which includes driving under the influence at the time of the crash. Foreman turned herself in back in May, about four and a half months after the accident. While she has been in court before for things like speeding and driving without a license, the incident with Graham was her first felony charge. That's why, according to the DA's office, her bail was only set at $7,500. She posted that bail and was released the same day and has been out of jail ever since. It is very disappointing to his family because here's this man probably debilitated for life. He was tragically hit. Can you still see his personality shining through? Very little, very little. Um, he was a happy, cheerful, playful person and he's not like that anymore. It may be a whole year later, but to Officer Graham and his family, it's just as hard as day one. His famous words to me all the time is, you have no idea what I'm going through. You don't know the pain that I'm in. You don't know how I feel. I don't wish this on anyone. You stand up and take a rest for a moment? Yeah. The case for the suspect, Shannon Foreman, will continue on February 5th with a status hearing. As for Graham's family, they have a lot more to say about all of this, and they have a special message of thanks to the community. You can catch all of that on our website, WKRG.com. In the studio, Brianna Hollis, WKRG News 5.